I'm Chan Cope, Provost to the Cathedral, and I'd like to welcome you to the service of prayer and remembrance for those lost to COVID-19. We invite you to submit the names of those lost to this pandemic at cathedral.org backslash COVID memorial. We pray over those names during our monthly service which will be available on our website and Facebook. These names will be kept here in the chapel of St. Joseph of Arimathea as a memorial and will continue to remain in the prayers of our community. I am resurrection and I am life, says the Lord. Whoever has faith in me even shall have life even though he die and everyone who has life and has committed himself to me in faith shall not die forever. As for me, I know that my Redeemer lives and that at the last he will stand upon the earth. After my awaking, he will raise me up and in my body I shall see God. I myself shall see and my eyes behold him who is my friend and not a stranger none of us has life in himself, and none becomes his own master when he dies. For if we have life, we are alive in the Lord, and if we die, we die in the Lord. So then, whether we live or die, we are the Lord's possession. God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. God of grace and glory, we remember before you this day our sisters, brothers, and siblings who have died as a result of COVID-19. Robert J. Kowalski, Michelle L. Regal, Eduardo Parra, Stephen Michael Zarkowski, Julio Garcia, Jr., Jose Antonio Razo, Joanne Spires, Tito Carrillo Gomez, Robert Boyd Worth, Juanita Topete Ponce, Marianne Vota, Panos Constant. Constantopoulos, Waldemar Gonzalez, Diana Marie Antweiler, Randy Whipple, John Ross Druba, John P. Marino, Jr., George Lewis Leggett, Robert Schrader, Roy Hallowell, Pamela Edwards, Oscar Conrad Dotson, Paul Anthony Letizzi, Peggy McPherson, Nels Hansen, LaRue Monk, 
Maria Weinzerl, Frank Pasquarella, Howard Munson, Sr., Pedro Rubio Hernandez, Jason Matthew Reynolds, Kenneth J. Duckett, Richard Garina, Lorna Veronica Gale, Donald R. Foss, Joan Hill Cunningham, Faye Traxler, Sandy Jensen Seeger Taylor, Stanley J. Yasset, The Reverend Bruce Byroli, Charlie Summers, Mary Ann Batinger, Pat Pelichia, Brian Bridges, Melbourne Rich, Fausto Pichardo, Mr. Boja in Hyderabad, India, Karen Langsford, Charles Edwin Rouse II, James Ball, Denzel Francis, Patricia Sessler, Carl W. Baynard, Sr., Shirley Jean Wardrobe Dietz, Terry Bythe, James Gerwitzman, Lois Alsept, and Mitchell Alsept. All those we love but see no more are not lost. Their names and lives are not forgotten. Gracious God, we now present these souls into your loving presence and protection. Grant them your peace and let light perpetual shine upon them. Amen. O God, whose mercies cannot be numbered, accept our prayers on behalf of your servants who have died from the coronavirus often alone without the comfort of family and friends or loving embrace. Give them your peace and grant them an entrance into the land of light and joy in the fellowship of your saints. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Most merciful God, whose wisdom is beyond our understanding, deal graciously with the family and friends of those who've lost loved ones to COVID in their grief. Surround them with your love, that they may not be overwhelmed by their loss, but have confidence in your goodness and strength to meet the days to come. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, amen. Let us pray. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And please join me in the prayers our Savior Christ taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Give rest, O Christ, to your servants with your saints, where sorrow and pain are no more, neither sighing, but life everlasting. You only are immortal, the creator and maker of mankind, and we are mortal, formed of the earth, and to earth shall we return. For so did you ordain when you created me, saying, You are dust, and to dust you shall return. All of us go down to the dust, but even at the grave we make our song, Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Father of all mercies and God of all consolation, 
You pursue us with untiring love and dispel the shadow of death with the bright dawn of life. Your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, by dying has destroyed our death and by rising restored our life. Enable us, therefore, to press on towards him so that after our earthly course is run, he may unite us with those we love when every tear will be wiped away. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen. Thank you.